floods in Kerala. Daily surveys are being carried out to check outbreak of diseases in relief camps. Rain has finally let up in Kerala and a red alert was withdrawn from all districts of the state on Sunday. The weather office has said that there has been a gradual decrease in rainfall on the state and floodwaters have begun to recede, relief and rescue operations are on and the first commercial flight has landed at the Inskaruta Kochi Naval Air Station. In spite of the signs of improvement in Kerala weather, thousands of people are still feared trapped and there have been reports of diseases in relief camps, although there is no major outbreak. Three people with chicken pox in one of the relief camps in Aluva town, nearly 250 kilometers from state capital Tiruvannantapuram, have been isolated as a precaution and daily surveys are being carried out to check any outbreaks. The government on Sunday told the National Crisis Management Committee that the Kerala flood situation was gradually improving. Here are the live updates on Kerala floods, advertisement August 20, 201812-03, East SEWA International, an Indian non-profit organization in America, has raised over $10,000 for the flood relief operations in the deluge hit Kerala. Over 5,000 SEWA volunteers have fanned out distributing food packets and cooking kits, and are opening free kitchens and medical camps to help the flood affected. Read story August 20, 201,811 to 44 East. The following trains are running as per regular schedule. Nizamuddin or Nakulam Mangala Lakshadeep Express Mangalore Nagar Coil Parasurum Express Jamnagar Tirunel Valley Express in Lokmanya Tilak Terminus Tiruvanantapuram Netravathi Express from Sharnar Junction August 20, 201,811 to 40 East. There has been no rain in central Kerala's Thrissur in the last 24 hours. People displaced by the floods have started returning homes. Relief agencies in Thrissur say they need more antiseptic soaps and disinfectants. Food packets and medicines are being dropped from helicopters. August 20, 201,811 to 28 East passengers at Insgaruda Kochi Naval Air Station is commercial flight service begins. First commercial flight landed early this morning, August 20, 201,811 to 23 East called a review meeting with the deputy chairman, Rajasabha on Kerala floods with senior officials of Rajasabha and vice president secretariat and decided to donate a month's salary for relief measures, Venkaya Naidu on Twitter Og 20, 201,811 to 10 East there'll be no electricity in homes. Carpentry, plumbing would be gone. We need hundreds of thousands of electricians, plumbers, carpet otters to rush to Kerala. We don't need clothes and food. People with technical capabilities are required to put life back into Kerala, KJ Alphonse is quoted by Ogni Aug 20, 201810 to 43 East, special page on Kerala. Visit for updates, stories and details on how and where to donate. Saturday, Jaiswal KP went down on all fours in nearly waist-deep water at a village in Malapuram, to help rescued women climb onto inflatable boats. Read August 20, 201,810 to 26 East, Chief Minister Pinarayi Vijayan announced that the government would honor fishing workers who were part of the rescue mission. All boats will be granted 3,000 rupees for each day of their work. Government will also bear the repairing costs of boats damaged during the mission. August 20, 201,810, 08, East, 55 doctors from JJ Hospital, 26 doctors from Pune's Sassoon Hospital and paramedical staff leave for Tiruvannantapuram in two Air India aircraft, Zog 20, 201,810, 04, East, a thank you note painted on the roof of a house where the naval ALH pilot rescued two women, Og 20, 201,809-51, East, floodwaters in Kerala may have begun to recede but the situation in relief camps is far from hopeful. No electricity, no mat to sleep on, people at a relief camp in rural Ernakulam say their living condition is difficult indeed. The camp at Oluva's UC College is just one of the 3,000 across Kerala where more than 6 lakh people have found shelter. Red August 20, 201,809-38 East, a doctor couple came to the aid of evacuees being brought to the camp in Kerala's Oluva, one of the worst affected in the state. The first two days thousands of people were being brought in. 
entire Aluva was completely cut off from the rest of world due to severe flooding. In the beginning, we somehow managed to send two patients to another hospital. But later I realized it was impossible to do so with everyone. So we both took it up, but it was extremely tough. Later more doctors joined us. I could sleep for only two to three hours for the first three days that I was here, 57-year-old Dr. Najib pulled in DT VOD 20, 201809-30 East, flood water has started receding in some areas of Kerala but there is a lack of clean drinking water and diseases due to mosquito infestation, especially in Kochi and Tiruvanantapuram VOD 20, 201809-18 East, the Western Naval Command on Sunday sailed Indian Naval ship in Mysore with relief material to provide assistance to the flood-hit state. On the night of August 19, the ship carried about 70 tons of relief material which includes bottled water, ready-to-eat meals, fresh ration, milk, biscuits, medicines, essential toiletries, fennel, gash bags, bleaching powder, and candles, August 20, 201,809-13, East. PLs RT to those who need to travel there ASAP. Picked at twitter.com slash qcrft5r1kc dash jet airways at jet airways august 20th 2018 august 20th 201809 east national disaster management authorities updates on kerala relief two xbsf boats from visage to tiruvanan to purim will reach today 60 t medicines from hendon to tiruvanan to purim 70 doctors the 70-seater passenger plane being operated by Alliance Air, a subsidiary of the state-run carrier Air India, is flying between Bengaluru and the Kochi Naval Base, Civil Aviation Minister Suresh Prabhu tweeted on Sunday, August 20, 201,808 to 37 East as Kerala fights back floods. Flights begin at Kochi Navy Base. 10 facts commercial flight operations to flood hit Kochi resumed today after the Navy activated its airstrips to accommodate small passenger aircraft. The first flight, an Alliance Air ATR plane, landed early this morning at Insgaruda Naval Air Station. The main Kochi airport will remain closed till August 26 as water is yet to recede from the facility, the country's seventh busiest. August 20, 201,808-33 East, visuals from inside the plane that landed today at Insgaruda August 20, 201,808-30 East, commercial flight operations to Kochi resume today. The first flight, an Alliance Air ATR plane, landed early this morning at Insgaruda Naval Air Station. The main Kochi airport will remain closed till August 26 as water is yet to recede. No more content.